Now to the Trump presidency and House Republicans introducing specifics of their tax plan today. They say that it helps the middle class and corporate America. CBS 4's Elliot Rodriguez in the control room with details. Elliot. Well, Rick, the GOP tax plan slashes the corporate tax rate and lowers taxes for most Americans, but it limits deductions for homeowners and the state income taxes that wouldn't affect us here in Florida since Florida does not have a state income tax. But the proposal adds $1.5 trillion to the national debt over the next decade. President Trump praised the tax plan House Republicans unveiled, predicting it'll pass by Christmas. And that's why we're working to give the American people a giant tax cut for Christmas. We are giving them a big, beautiful Christmas present in the form of a tremendous tax cut. It will be the biggest cut in the history of our country. The proposal reduces the number of brackets from seven down to four, keeping the top bracket at 39.6 percent. It aims to double the standard tax from 12000 to 24000 The home mortgage interest deduction would stay in place. Americans will still be able to deduct their property taxes. However, the deduction for state and local taxes would go away. The Fed, federal government shouldn't be picking winners and losers and giving high state tax uh, folks an advantage over low state tax. The proposal limits the home mortgage deduction at $500,000. The local property tax limit would be 10000 But you can still contribute up to $18,000 tax-free to your 401k. And the child tax credit increases from $1,000 to $1,600 per child. We're going to get this done because we told the American people this is what we're going to do if we get this majority. And guess what? We're doing it. Democrats say the plan is just another way for Republicans to push through tax cuts for the wealthiest Americans. The priorities of the Ryan McConnell bill have been clear from the start, perpetuating a catastrophic transfer of wealth from the middle class to corporations and the wealthy. Now, Republicans say a family of four making $60,000 a year would get a $1,200 tax cut. Wealthy Americans would also benefit from the repeal of the alternative minimum tax and a phase-out of the estate tax. Rick and Rudube, back to you.